Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today I'm going to show you the easiest way to enable multitasking gestures on either your iPhone 4 or your iPod Touch 4th generation. Now this only works for, again, the iPhone 4 or the iPod Touch 4th generation. So what you're going to do is uh, obviously be jailbroken if you aren't already jailbroken. I will have a video down below in the more info where you guys can check it out and you can obviously uh, end up jailbreaking your iPhone or iPod Touch. And what you're going to do is simply load up Cydia and I'm going to show you again how to enable multitasking gestures via something called MT gestures which obviously is short for multitasking gestures so inside of Cydia just go to the search tab at the bottom and search for MT gestures as you can see it instantly comes up and it is free so you do not have to pay at all and it is already on the mod my eye repository which does mean that you do not have to add any custom repositories just simply go to it hit install and and then hit confirm and if you don't already have winterboard installed it will install that because it is a dependency and once that is installed then it will force you to reboot either your iPhone or iPod touch once you have done that you can go inside of winterboard and enable it but really quick I'm just going to show you guys that inside of settings I do not have multitasking gestures enabled now it will be above airplane mode once it is enabled so I'm just going to show you guys how to do it again just open up winterboard and once Winterboard is loaded up, go to Select Themes, and then simply either choose iPhone 3, 1, underscore 4.3.1, underscore gestures, or the one for the iPod Touch, if you have either the iPhone or iPod Touch. Now, because I am on an iPhone 4, I'm going to pick the iPhone one, and then simply just press the home button and it will respring. Now what this does is it basically just switches out the plist files. Now I made a video on how to actually add in the plist files yourself. However, this does it and it just switches them in and out with Winterboard. So when you turn it off, it just takes out those uh, modded plist files and puts in the stock ones. So that's how it ends up working out. And as you can see at the top, now I do get something called multitasking gestures. And I'll just give you a quick demonstration. So I can use either four or five fingers, and this does include the thumb. And I can go to the home screen just if it'll work. Sometimes it's a little uh, glitchy, but most of the time it works correctly. So I'm just going to go inside of WordPress and show you guys that you can close out like that. You can also bring up your multitasking bar simply by swiping up like that, close it just by swiping down, and you can switch between open applications once you're inside of it. You just simply swipe over like so, and it goes between all of your open applications. So that's basically it. It's really easy, really simple to do. I hope you guys like this video. Please remember to let me know what you think in the comment section below, and also be sure to hit that subscribe button if you aren't already subscribed for more great videos. And until next time, this is ICU, signing out.